programming is all about playing with codes. Or, we can say, programming is just like a puzzle of words. In the previous video, we had created a graphical user interface software by writing just three lines of code in Python. Each line has a particular meaning of its own. Import tkinter, this line is used to import a module, whose name is tkinter. T is equal to tkinter.tk, this line is used to create a main window of our software. Here, T is a variable. This means that in the place of t, you can use any variable of your choice. For example, top is equal to tkinter dot tk. t dot main loop creates a loop which tracks all the action like click or drag performed by a user who is working on our application software. tkinter.tk means a function named tk is called or invoked, which is available under tkinter module. Suppose, in this line, you want to change the variable t, and, you want to take a new variable as top. Then, in that case, you have to edit the second line. At the place of t, write the name of the variable that you want to take. Here, I'm taking a new variable as top. Now, to run the program correctly, you have to change the next line as well. Now, run the program. You'll see an error-free execution of your program. And, a main screen window of your newly created software will appear on your screen. Let's talk about our main application window. This window has a title bar. This window has a title bar, which contains a logo, a title of our application, a minimize button, a restore down button, and a close button. The default size of our application window is 500 to 500 pixels. You can edit this size by just adding a single line of code in the previous code. Between the second and third line, type t.geometry. Then write the size of x-axis, and then the size of y-axis. Now press F5 key and observe the output. Well done! You had resized your software's application window. Do you want to set, a title, and, a logo, on the title bar of your application's window? This you'll learn, in our upcoming videos. If you like the video, then go, and hit the like button. Share this video with your friends too. Don't forget to subscribe the channel to stay updated with our latest videos.